Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. And in this video, we're gonna go over some of the top five features in macOS Sonoma. So let's get right into it. Before we get started, let's make sure that you're up to date to macOS Sonoma. So to check your Mac's version number, we just need to go to the Apple in the top left hand corner, then click about this Mac. And then your version number will be right here. Let's start by going over widgets. In macOS Sonoma, Apple added the ability to add widgets to the desktop. So to get started, we're going to open Notification Center. Once it's open, we're going to click Edit Widgets. And then we're going to be greeted with this new panel that looks pretty similar to iPadOS. So we can either drag a widget from Notification Center onto our desktop, or we can select a widget from the new widget gallery. So I'm going to probably drag this Reminders widget. As you can see, I can place them just about anywhere, or I can have them clip with the side of another widget that I already have placed. You can also scroll through the widgets on the side view or search for a particular widget that you're looking for. You can also add iPhone widgets that will work when your iPhone is on the same Wi-Fi connection or near your Mac. And when you open an app, your widgets will go into this monochrome state so that you can focus on what you're working on. You can change this in settings though. Another new feature in macOS Sonoma is the ability to create web apps. So as you can see, I already have X as a web app. And I'm going to give you a quick demo with Apple.com. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go up to File, then go all the way down to Add to Dock. And then we're going to click Add. And as you can see, Apple.com goes straight into the bottom of my dock and it looks just like a normal application. And what's even better is that they do not rely on Safari to be open. So I can quit Safari and then open apple.com. And as you can see here, it functions just like a normal web page. I can click on links and it almost feels like you're just using an app, not even a web page. It's a pretty cool feature and it's nice to see Apple adding it. Let's go over wallpapers and screensavers in macOS Sonoma. So in this update, Apple has added a new wide variety of wallpapers and screensavers, but there is something different about them. They can act as both a screensaver and a wallpaper. So if we check out this one I have here, we lock my Mac, you're going to see that it begins to move. But when I unlock my Mac, it comes to a slow stop. So let's check out some of the ones Apple has added. So we're going to head over to settings. And then we're going to go under wallpaper and now you're going to see a wide variety of landscape seascape underwater earth and other wallpapers and screensavers so one that comes pre-installed in mac os sonoma is called sonoma horizon and so sonoma horizon can act as both a screensaver and a wallpaper and if you don't want that to happen you can actually disable it by clicking this toggle but it will act similarly to the Mac OS Sonoma graphic. So if I'm to lock this Mac, you're gonna see that the Mac wallpaper begins to move. But the minute I unlock it, it comes to a slow stop. Do keep note that not all wallpapers will act as a screensaver, but most of the new wallpapers that were added in Sonoma will support this. Now let's talk about game mode. So on macOS Sonoma, Apple added a new mode called Game Mode that automatically turns on when playing a game in full screen. It will prioritize the CPU and GPU performance to give you the best gaming experience you can, and it will double the Bluetooth sampling rate so that you have lower latency with AirPods, Bluetooth keyboards, and mice. Finally, let's talk about autocorrect. So Apple improved autocorrect on macOS Sonoma and iOS 17. It now has a new algorithm that learns from the way you type to give you more accurate results, and it now offers predictive text. And those are some of the top five new features and changes on macOS Sonoma. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe for more videos like this, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.